going on YouTube. Uh, it's good to see your pretty faces out there. Another quick unboxing for you guys. So this is the uh, Adidas Equipment uh, EQT Support Ultra PK Prime Knit. Um, not sure why the box doesn't say Pusher. Uh, obviously this is the Pusher T um, EQTs. Now on the previous two pairs, the, the white, or the cream pair and the black pair of the EQT um, Guidance, they both had, they both said Pusher on the box, on the label. For some reason this new pair doesn't, it just says PK. Uh, who knows. Um, anyway, straight into the box, got the delivery note from Adidas. King Pusher paper, same as on the guidance um, support. First shoe. Second shoe. Nothing else in the box. Move that out of the way for a second. Um, so what this comes with on here, we've got the same sort of tag as the Yeezy. Um, with the PRC in Hong Kong, uh, UK, France. We've got the product uh, label, which is EQT Support Ultra P. Uh, care label, and then we've got a spare set of laces, which are, they look, they're not waxed. They're pretty much the same as the laces that are in already. It's just a second pair for some reason. Um, both shoes are identical, so I'm going to talk through this one because it hasn't got the shit hanging off it. Uh, the only difference is on the um, lace bars here, if I can get this one to focus in. This one says King. And this one says Push. King Push. Um, okay, so what we've got on this shoe then, different to the uh, previous King Pushers, the EQT Guidance. Um, is we've got a prime knit upper, full prime knit upper uh, on top of a boost sole, a full boost sole it's actually an ultra boost sole as well so the best kind of boost but what we've got is, uh, I'll start from the bottom so we've got a, an all white outsole white uh, torsion insert, torsion bar and insert white on the inside, on the outside here, sorry on the inside heel part here um, continental rubber, white boost midsole, full boost midsole, and then that sits uh, on sitting on top of that is a full grey prime knit upper, collared sock, prime, like an NMD, uh, and then obviously we've got a, a heel cage around here, which is scales. It's actually real scales as well, which is pretty cool. Feels really nice. This follows around onto the inside to this uh, first lace um, lace bar, lace lock, which is all scaled. Um, we have scales around the front, from here, over, and then onto the inside as well. Prime knit to the toe. Prime knit toe box. Um, we've got these grey stripes which go up and through the material, and then obviously the lace uh, lace bars are attached onto here. Flat grey laces, square grey patch to the tongue, which is scaled as well. And I'm not going to be able to get to show it on here, but it says the Adidas equipment uh, ADV 9116. pretty cool. Uh, we've got the lines on the inside which if anybody doesn't know they're actually the measuring uh, measuring gauge on a set of scales for measuring cocaine which is obviously what the King Push is all about for those of you that didn't know. Um, but yeah that's, that's what's to the insole and that's pretty much the shoe. So it was a really quick one not going to say any more about them. 
I'll show you them both together, King Push. But yeah, thanks for watching guys, that was my review of the uh, 2006 17 um, King Push EQT Support Ultras Prime Mints, Ultra Prime Mints. Thanks for watching guys, as always, hit the thumbs up, hit the subscribe button and stay tuned for more. Peace.